today and is included once again Ayanda Mbambi and Delano Aprins up top in instead of Tabang Siba. Yeah, the formation they'll be playing a 4-4-2. Um, Piani up top will be the target man, the point of reference. And when you're looking at the back, Sisha uh, Gamu. Punch their tickets to the semi finals of the 2024 Netbank Cup as that particular mark you mentioned as Tux gets a very early opportunity here to break the deadlock. Uh, as far as all competitions go, it's been 19 matches since that. He's been able to make serious progress here as it slipped through nicely. Pushed out uh, a little wide was Zwane. Here's Morena. Played it across goal rather than attempting to squeeze it in. Hipero will get an opportunity. Oh, and he's bent it into the top corner with that absolute wonder of a left foot that he possesses. Educated left foot. Patient. Ways for the defender to commit, to be able to unleash that unstoppable... Oh, Miami, he continues on, rolled into the bottom, Morena. And it's a big save by Mayova. It's going to be a long night. Out swinging delivery, played in and turned just wide. Anthony Lafour. With half a dozen goals. They're looking for another here, Sundance. Big opportunity for Miami. He works set piece. And Delano Abrams gets another Ned Bank Cup goal. Goal number five in all competitions for Tux. He wins the foul for Tux. The ball is flighted into the far post. And you can see it's from the training ground. You play the ball. Measuring out his run up and it is him who takes a oh, hole and he's hit the target and Mayova has had to fly across goal to get a glove on that. A wonderful save. Now Allende and Hipero has misplaced his header. The discipline, the shape, but in the last... Samuel Julius and Abrams! A shot straight down the throat of Ronan Williams, mercifully for the Sundowns goalkeeper. So we will head to extra time here. Laid off for Hibero. He'll get another bite here. Oh, and he chooses to set it for McQuinn on the edge of the area. He shot. Oh, he has a go. Over gets a glove on that Sundowns perspective, considering how high their players are pushed up as Shalalile is able to turn his man, gets the shot off, gets the corner. Excellent pass, excellent pass from Mumbala. Look at that hold up play, he spins now. Maseko, an opportunity to use his fresh legs, still he continues on. Maseko. Blasted it over. Good pace, good skill. Flick, launch with the turn. Oh! So close to winning it for Mamelodi Sundowns. The man who starred as they came through their round of 16 obligation has turned it wide. Good ball coming from Ronan Williams. Peter Shalulile important. Net Bank Cup will be settled on spot kicks. In December though, in the preliminary round of this competition. McQuenna sets the tone. Emphatically struck past the best gloveman in the land. Mm. Great penalty. Mayova went the right way, but it was too far out of reach. Williams does what Williams does. Not the best penalty. 
and he will keep those out all day long. Quarterfinals. Push a moment for Serino and an opportunity to consolidate their advantage. And he's denied. It's back even. Two penalties each. Only one successfully converted. To try and nudge Tucks ahead once again. And Petty can't get it right. The long-time servant of the University of Pretoria Football Club hasn't given Williams nearly enough to think about. He's been able to amend what he usually does and to good effect here. Now can Hibero put Sundowns ahead for the first time. He can indeed. Advantage in the shootout. 2-1 after three kicks apiece. The difference in the goal. With Mamalodi Sundowns up against Ronwin Williams. And he has stuck it away. That's a good pin. And he would have had a lot of pressure on him having seen William. The run up suggests that this will be anything but delicate. Oh! <laughs> well, he's fooled me. And he's fooled my over. My over standing stunt says to me is flat footed because he to stay alive in the shootout the man who gave them life during regulation time squares up to Williams Abrams sticks it away and it will come down to a fifth sundowns kick converts and it's over they're into we have to make the save he took his... Excels in these kind of areas from open play. From 12 yards now with the pressure on. Shalulile to send Sundowns into the semi-finals and he does just that. The Sundowns are through the first team into the last four of this season's Nedbank Cup. It was touch and go, but they get the job done. Not in the way that many would have anticipated.